Simeo is proud to announce their latest software release, Simeo 14. This video will guide you through all the new and exciting features and enhancements that has been introduced to Simeo since the last major release. Extras Library There is a third library option below the library objects. This is the Extras Library. We think you will find that this library establishes an excellent foundation and framework for manufacturing modeling. Initial Set of Extras Library Objects Bay A bay defines a rectangular region over which cranes may move. Crane A crane is moved by a cab and may pick up and drop off entities at nodes that fall within the specified bay. Robot A composite object that represents a robot. The robot hand is a transporter that can pick up and drop off entities. Select the hand to edit its properties. Rack A rack is used to hold entities for a specified storage time. A rack can be used with a lift truck for placing items on different shelves within the rack. Lift truck A lift truck object may be used to transport entity objects between node locations. When used in conjunction with a rack, the lift on the lift truck will move vertically to the appropriate shelf height before executing a pickup or drop-off. Additionally, an on-demand routing type lift truck may be used as a movable resource that is seized and released for non-transport related tasks by model process logic. Elevator an elevator is used to carry entities in a vertical direction between a collection of elevator nodes. Elevator node. An elevator node defines an entry and exit node for the entities that ride on an elevator. Each elevator node references its associated elevator, and each elevator references a list of associated elevator nodes. Enhanced units per resource logic. This customer requested feature allows the units per resource property in C step, release step, and resource availability constraint logic to be a resource dependent value. This allows for easier modeling of secondary resource capacity unit requirements. Now, if using a data table to define the resource list members, the units per resource property may be specified as another column in the table. Multi layer modeling. This highly requested feature allows users to place objects, animation graphics, and symbols in different layers. You can then render certain layers invisible, allowing for objects, animation graphics, and symbols to be hidden. This feature resides on the Visibility tab. Each object only lives in one layer, and this could be useful for highlighting certain areas of a model or modeling multi-level designs. Enable Disable Automatic Bound Table and Log Exporting RPS only. This feature allows users to alter a global setting to turn on and off the automatic exporting of all bound tables and logs. This is best used while testing and debugging models where you wish to reduce time by not exporting tables and logs repeatedly. Note, you can still manually export tables and logs even when this setting is false. Ability to duplicate a model without having to go to the project window. This feature allows for a simpler way to copy a model's definition. This feature can be used by right-clicking on the model you wish to duplicate and then selecting Duplicate Model. Q-Line Externally Visible Toggle This user-requested feature allows objects to appear where an invisible queue is located. This per queue toggle is accessed by right-clicking on a queue and clicking Queue Line Externally Visible. Turning this toggle off will render the queue invisible, but objects will still appear in the queue's location in an external space. Enhance Color Picker This feature was implemented to improve the animation in Simeo. This feature was intended to give you a more dynamic color selection throughout Simeo, as well as provide the ability for custom colors in your animation. Note, custom colors can have transparency. However, proceed with caution as the behavior may not do exactly what you expect. New Sim Bits Constraint Logic 
This simbit contains three models demonstrating the use of constraint logic elements for modeling constraint-driven situations. Merging conveyors controlled by gate. This simbit contains three models demonstrating the use of a resource as a gate for merging conveyors. Transporting varying seized entities. This simbit contains two models demonstrating a modeling approach for considering an entity's size for loading on a transporter with limit capacity. Auto create paths with vertices. This simbit contains one model that demonstrates a modeling approach for auto creating links that have vertices in them. Thank you for choosing Simeo. To view the full release notes, please visit the release notes section under our resources tab on simeo.com.